Hello, welcome to Full Body Workout. Today you're going to need um, dumbbells and a mat. Um, this is a bit of a strength workout. Um, warm up and cool down are both included and we're doing five exercises for five rounds. Um, and then we'll maybe add a little bit of abs on the end and we'll see how much time we have. So um, let's just get started with the warm up. Um, first, what we're going to do is you're going to start with squat and kick. So you're coming down. Kicking out to the side. Down, kicking out to the side. Good. Nice high kick. Warming up those legs. Getting ready to go. Three, two, and one. Good. Now I want you to do rope climb, so if you've got a mat, stand on it. You're gonna pretend you have a rope right in front of you. And we're just going up, 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 using those arms to help us bring up those knees, nice and heavy. Good, breathe in the heart. Yeah. Ten, five, four, three, two, and one. Good. All right, if you go down onto your mat, palms facing forward, up into a kind of bridge. You're gonna do opposite foot, opposite hand. Just tapping. Good. Waking up those core muscles. Do some coordination. Five more, five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Come on to your front, into a plank position. We're just going to do some thrusters, opening up those hips. So bringing forward one leg and back, other leg and back. Just going to do a few of these, waking up those legs and hips. Good. Giving two more each side. Keep breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. Last one. Good. Walk yourself back up. We're going to do a few more of those squatting kicks. This time we're kicking to the front. So you're kicking, squatting down, kicking forward. Squatting down, kicking forward. Keep that back nice and straight on those squats. Leaning back like you're going to sit on a chair. Keeping the back nice and straight. Good. Three, two, and one. Good. Okay, back to the rope climb. We're going to do 20 seconds. Let's go. Knees nice and high. Five, four, three, two, and one, good. Down to the floor. Palm, palms facing forward, pushing up. Opposite two, opposite knee, or opposite arm. Just tapping. If that's too much, you can do it from the ground. Don't hold yourself up. It's always an option. Three, two, and one. Back to those mountain climbers. I'll try thrusters. So, hands in the plank. Bring one foot forward, stretch one the hip. Bring the back, other foot forward. Good. Two more each side. Good. One more. Well done. Okay, I'm just going to go through that sequence one more time and then we're ready to go. So, squat and kick. This time I want you to kick to the side, kick to the front. Kick to the side, kick to the front. Good.
One more each side. And good. All right, rope climb. Let's go. Knees nice and high. Using those arms. Ten. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Okay. Back dive. Pass my knees. So tap in. about balance, coordination, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, let's rest your shoulder the last time, feel the warm really. I just want three each side, so let's go. And back, change, and back, change, good. And back. One more each side. Last one. Good. Walk yourself back up. Get yourself a quick drink. And I'll talk you through the five exercises that we're going to do. Now, okay, so first exercise is going to be a snatch. So we're working in tens. Each exercise ten times. So you want to put that dumbbell in front of you. You're bending down to get it. You're coming up and pushing it overhead. Coming back down, setting it down, picking it back up, pushing it overhead. All right, bending those knees to pick it up. I'll do it from the side so you can see it. So bend those knees. Bring it up past the shoulder, pushing up. All right? So we're going to do 10 of those each side. Then we've got 10 renegade rows. We've done these before. So you're in the plank position. Knees, feet nice and wide. Pulling up, pulling up. All right, keeping, this, keeping it nice and close to the body while you're pulling up, squeezing those shoulder blades at the top. Then we're going to do goblet squats, so holding the dumbbells either one or two, right in front of you in a goblet position, feet nice and wide, coming down, squeezing back up. Push ups on the dumbbells is the fourth one. I'll talk you through them again as we're going through, it's just to give you a quick break, get a quick look into what we're doing. So, feet nice and wide if you need to, coming down and pushing up. And then the last one is core yes is plank pull through so you go on you only need one dumbbell for this one you go into the plank position you're bringing the dumbbell just behind your hands feet nice and wide again just to give you a stable base pulling that dumbbell across placing that hand back then going with the other side keeping those hips nice and still the whole time the only thing that's moving is that hand all right so we're starting with the snatches 10 each side, getting ready to go in three, two, and one. So down you go, push it up, set it down, up, three, four, five, six. You can add that jump in if you need to, seven, eight, Nine and ten. Other side then. Same thing. Watch the lights. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Last one. 10, good. Okay, renegade row. Let's go. Bringing those dumbbells down, getting into the plank position. Feet nice and wide. And we're doing 10 each side. So pulling up, 
squeezing. Pull them up, squeezing, that's one. Now I'll count. Two. Keeping that core nice and tight. Three. Four. Good. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. No twist in those hips. Keep those hips nice and steady. Come on. Nine. Last one. Ten. Good. Up you come. Goblet squat. So either hold one dumbbell or two. Whatever feels best for you. Nice wide stance. Going down. Pulling up. Squeezing those glutes. Two. Three. Back is switched on when we're holding them in this position. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Okay, dumbbell push ups. So, using those dumbbells as your base, coming into the plank position, you can do these on your toes or on your knees. I'll show you the first five on my toes and then I'll show you on your knees. It's the same thing. So, I'll show you knees first so you can do them. So feet behind, down and up. Let's go. Two, three, four, and five. Keep going, five to go. This is on your toes, six, seven. So keep going on your knees if you need to. Eight, nine, and 10. Try a few on your toes. Go down to your knees, whatever's best for you. Okay, last exercise. Pulling that dumbbell to the side, just behind the arms. Coming into the plank position, making sure those arms are directly below the shoulders. Nice wide feet once again. And then you're gonna pull through. Alternate, pull through. Good. So bringing it back to the original position is one. Keep remembering to pull that core tight. That's us on five. Good. Keeping those hips level. Couple more. core work. Last one, 10, good. All right, well done, one round done, complete. I'm gonna open the window because it's roasting already. Okay, so a bit of strength work, working through the rounds, making sure we're executing the exercises with good form. Focusing on the exercises rather than pushing through on a timer. So, bit of a different style, but still great for working out, great for a burn. Okay, going back to those snatches, I'm gonna come up a little bit forward because I hit the light the last time. So, back to those snatches, round two, let's go. Up, set down, up. Good. Halfway. Six. Bring your light the way up. Last one. Good. Swap over. Halfway. Okay, last one. Nice, okay. Renegade row. Getting strong backs. So onto the plank. Position. Wide stance. Let's go, pull it up. Squeezing on the shoulder blades. 
holding that core tight. That's it, come on. Nine, last one. Good. Okay, up for your squats. Let's go. Goblet position, wide feet, push them back, squeeze it up. Good. Breathe it on the way up. Two more. Good. Okay, push ups. All right. You can do these on your, just on your hands. If you have rest pain and it gets too much on the dumbbells. So you judge for yourself what's best for you. Okay, let's go. Nice wide feet or on your knees. Good, 10. Okay, dumbbell pull through. Then you get a break. One dumbbell behind your hands. Into that plank. Let's go straight in. Come on, nice wide feet. The only thing that moves is the hand. Keeping that core pulled in. Don't move those hips. Good. Working the lats here as well. I've lost count. I'm talking too much. Okay, give me two more. Nine. Last one. And ten. Good. Okay, let's take, take a quick drink. That's two rounds done. Whew. You got this. You can do it. I'm fully sweating. Sweat is dripping off me. I'm like right there with you. Whew. Sorry. I also feel tired today, so it doesn't help me, but you have to push through. Get it done, you always feel better after, so. Okay, get ready for those snatches. All right, get ready to go in three, two, and one. Let's go. Push it up, bending those knees, keeping that form right above the head. You can do it. Come on, that's your halfway. Use that jump to help you get it up. This is when the jump comes in. When you start to get tired. Woo! It helps you get it up. 10, well done, other side. One. Sitting back when you're bending down. Six, come on. Seven. Woo! Eight. Nine, ten, well done. Okay, rows. This is so taxing on the upper body. Okay, let's go. Ready again, row. Feet nice and wide. Arms nice and flat into the side of your body. Keep them nice and close. Keep breathing. Squeezing that shoulder blade at the top. Keeping that core nice and tight. Don't move the hips. You have three more today, come on. 
Two more today. Last one each side. Come on. Well done. Okay. This set's a mind game for me. Woo! Once I get the third set done, I'm good. Not good, but I can get through. It's hard, it's hard. Okay, squats, let's go. Squeezing those glutes, come on. Eight. Nine. And ten, good. Okay, what are we on? Push ups. Try a few on your toes. Go to your knees if you need to. Do as many as you can on those toes. Challenge yourself. Come on, let's go. Wide stance will help you. The narrower your feet, the harder it is. Ah! Get on my knees. Keep pushing. Nine, last one. Come on, ten. Good. Okay, one dumbbell. We're doing the pull throughs. All right. Oh my goodness. Let's go. Wide stance, core tight, pull through. One done. Halfway, come on. I'm slipping with sweat. It's disgusting. Oh. Nine. Last one. Ah. Try to help me. Ten. Oh. Okay, let's take a quick break. two rounds to do. You can do it. I'll add some variation this round to get us through it. Change it up a bit. And then we're on the last round after that. So two rounds to go. Feeling sweaty, feeling good, feeling tired, but pushing through. All right, let's get it done. Ready for those snatches? My hair's everywhere, thank goodness. Oh. Okay, I need to go back to bed, I think. Okay, ready for those snatches? Three, two, and one, let's go. Push it up, come on. Bend down, push up. Five. Good, other side. Count it in your own time. Good, ten. Okay. Ready to get it Change it up a little bit. We're going to do 10 on one side and then 10 on the other. So all 10 reps on one side and then all 10 reps on the other. Okay, so pick your side. I'm going to start with the left. Doing 10, swap it over. Nice wide stance. One, two, same arm. Three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, good, ten. Okay, go to the other side then. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! See how it changes it? Crazy. Really working on strength there, keeping your side up, holding that core nice and tight. Okay, goblet squat. We're gonna add a pulse. My watch is going crazy, I don't know what's going on. All right, goblet squat. Down, pulse, up. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one. Ten. Good. All right, down to those push ups. Again, it's up to you whether you do them on the dumbbells or on your arms, whether you do them on your knees or your feet. Let's go, let's get them done. Breathing out, no air. Ten, well done. All right, dumbbell pull through. You can do it, come on. Let's just go, get it done. Nice wide stance, up into that plank, holding. Good. Only thing that moving is that arm. Keep the hips still. Hands are moving, do the sweat. You can drop the knees if you need to. It's the same thing. I'll show you now, there we go. On the knees, pulling through. If that needs to be an option for you, that's totally fine. Two more. Last one. Okay, good. Take a quick break. We're going into the last round. Before we go into the last round, we're just going to do a pulse raiser. 30 seconds of it. Just to raise that heart rate before we start. So we're going to do squat touch. So you're going touch, back in, touch, back in. If you don't want to do the jump, I out, touch, in, in, out, out, touch. Okay? We're doing 30 seconds. We're starting in three. Two, and one, let's go. Good, keep breathing. This is gonna be the last round. You can do it. Halfway, come on, 15 seconds left. Keep jumping, keep touching. Keep breathing, three, Two, one, all right. Straight into those snatches. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Legs are burning. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good. Other side, let's go. One, two, three, four, whew, five, halfway, six, seven, eight, nine, last one, ten, good. Okay, renegade rows. Oh my goodness. 
Let's just do them normal. So alternating sides. One glass out of the way. Three, two, one. Let's go. Come on. One, one, two. Squeeze in those shoulder blades. Two. Keeping that core tight. Good. Keep breathing. Halfway. Last one. Okay, well done. Oh my goodness. Okay. Guys, I'm right there with you. I'm so tired. Okay. Goblet squats with a pulse. Let's go. Pulse. Two more. Let's go down for 10 pulses. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Well done. Ten push-ups, ten pulls, Bruce. And you're done. Come on. Let's go on the push-ups. finish. Come on. Let's do it. Last exercise. Don't slack now. Keep that form the whole way through. Let's go. Hands under shoulders. Feet nice and wide. Core nice and tight. And pull. Hips steady. Core tight. Two done. Shaking. Okay, that's five. Come on. Four today. Three today. Two today. One today. Oh, done. Done, done, done. Well done. Take a drink. minutes of hard work. Oh goodness. Well done guys, well done. No, I, I have planned on doing six minutes of abs. I will still do it. <laughs> Maybe not very enthusiastically. So it's three exercises, loop twice for a minute. Um, so if you want to skip on to the cool down and stretch, please do. If you want to stay with me and be hardcore and struggle, then that's totally fine. Please stay with me, keep me company while I do this. Okay, so three exercises, one minute each, times by two, gives us six minutes of pure abs. What was I thinking? So wood chop is the first one. So we're going to do 30 seconds one way. Actually, we'll just do a minute and then we'll change over the second time. So bend and down, then bear crawl. I'll show you that on your mat. And straight leg set up. So legs straight up and we're crunching with the dumbbell. But I'll show you those as we go because we'll have time. Let's just get it done. Let me get my timer. Where is it? Here it is. Okay, starting in three, two, and one. Pick a side. Stick to that side for the minute. 
and then we'll swap over and um, we'll, we'll do it next time. So right up, follow the dumbbell with your eyes, right down, bending in, getting those obliques. Good. Nice and slowly. You have a minute, so you can pace yourself. Starting to feel it now. Good. 20 seconds to go. Almost there. Woo. Five, three, two, and one. Okay, we're going straight into bear crawl. So, on your hands and knees. Then you're going to lift those feet up, or those knees up off the ground. So on your tiptoes, walking forward, nice and slowly. Opposite arm, opposite leg, goes forward, and then same for back. You want to keep that back as straight as you can, as if you've got a glass of water on your back, and you don't want to spill it. So go the length of your mat, or whatever you're on, and then back. And these are difficult. I find these really hard. Keeping those knees close to the ground, don't let them come up. 10 seconds left. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, on your back, grab a dumbbell, just one. Hopefully you can see me. <laughs> Legs straight up and crunch. Crunch. Shoulders right off the ground. Keep your eyes fixed on something. I'm shaking all over. Good. Almost there. 15 seconds left. Keep those legs straight. Keep crunching up. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Oh my word, okay. Just repeat that then, so back to wood top. Pick the other side. Up and down, up and down. Good. Follow that dumbbell with your eyes. Working those obliques. All right, 15 seconds, come on. left come on I'm so tired as well oh my goodness okay 10 seconds let's do it come on three two one on your back last exercise grab your weight 
Feet up and crunch. Good. All right, last 30. We're doing opposite ones. 15 seconds each. One arm comes up, one arm on your head. Three, two, one. Swap over. Other arm comes up. That arm goes to your head. Good. Five seconds left. Three, two, one. You're done. You're done. You're done. I'm done. Oh, hug those knees into your chest. Go side to side. Well done, well done, well done. Okay, up to your feet. For those of you who have skipped forward and not done the abs, we need to curl down. For those of you who have done the abs, let's just go this nice and slow. So you're squatting down, kicking out, just like we did at the start. Squatting down, kicking out. Just nice and slow, let the heart rate lower. One more each side. Good. Come down onto that mat. Let's see those thrusters from the start. So just squeezing out those, or stretching out those hips into the plank, bringing one forward, sitting there for a second, returning it, bringing the other one up. Good. Okay, back to that first leg. Now I want you to take the same hand and rotate it round. Come back down. Give me two more rotations. Up and down. Last one. Up and down, good. Return that leg, other side then. So three rotations on the same arm. Two. And three, good, okay. Bring your back down into child's pose, pushing that back, right back, sitting down into it. Stretching out, getting those arms as long as they can. Going up on the fingertips for an extra stretch. Lovely. Now I want you to come up. I'm going to do some cat collie. So I want you to push right up, create a bend, come right over, head up. Right up, knee, chin to chest, pushing up, hunching, bringing it back. Give me two more. Last one. Good. Okay, coming up to on your knees. I want you to stretch out those arms. So one in front of the other, pulling across. Good, other side. Well done. Okay, up and over, so stretch out that tricep. Really good work today, other side. It was tough, it was good, it was sweaty. I can't wait for a shower. Okay, chest, so arms out in front, head down, pushing forward. Sorry for your back. I can't even think. Head down, pushing forward, feeling that back, stretching out. Good. Three, two, and one. Bring the hands back and push them back, stretching out that chest. Do your neck while you're here, so over to one side, over to the other. Back to the first side and back to the other. Good, okay, overhead. We work those obliques, so leaning in and over, holding, stretching a wee bit further, holding, good, other side. Stretching right over. As you exhale, lean a little bit further. One more each side. So lean over, exhale, stretching out more. Last one. 
exhale in and over. Good. Okay, I just want you to do quads and hamstrings and then we're done. So stand up, pulling that leg up, stretching like that quad. Other side then. Ooh. Good. Okay, hamstrings and you're done. So wide stance. Push and down, keeping those legs slightly bent, not completely locked out. Go as far as you can. Hopefully you can reach the ground. If not, that's totally fine. Go to where you can go. As you exhale, lean a little bit further in. If you're on the floor, walk your hands back. Feel a nice stretch in the hamstrings. Walk forward, come back up. Head the last thing to come up. And well done, good job. Drink plenty of water, go have a shower. Whew, it was good work today. So if you need to stretch out later again, do that if you get tight and have a great day.